everyone. Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Knife29, and here's what's in our backpack. We're a little underweight, which is always good. Um, I didn't really do much in here. I mean, I ate all my cattails to fill my belly up, but that was it, basically. So there we are, day nine, day eight, there. Uh, here's our skills. Cooking is at two. And there we go. And we're almost nighttime. Hey, Pinguino, welcome in. And thank you for the follow. All right, let's get over to the dam. And, hmm, should I go that way? Wolves that way. Let's not, let's go this way. You've killed your first bear non-episode. Non-episode two bear. Nice. So like in survival? That's actually, uh, it's exciting, I guess. And when, like, I, I don't remember when I got my first one, but. I'm pretty sure I was fairly excited when I know you're in episode four. Oh, okay, that's fine. I'm trying to remember the story. It's which is funny because I played it a lot. But if you stick around, you'll notice I have a terrible memory. <laughs> it's kind of my thing. So do you play survival at all, or are you still just playing story? Episode 4 is the prison one with Mackenzie. Oh, okay. Yeah, so that's a real bear then. That's not a... That's not the scripted one in... Whatever chapter that was. 2 or 3? The big bear. Rarely challenges and whichever one you feel like, yeah. I didn't even count. I got six. And I should hurry. I'm going to check the hunting blind before continuing. And grab some feathers over here. Oh, we got all four out of you. Oh, you play on Switch? So no tails. I don't have a Switch, so I'm not sure, but I think at some point you'll probably get it. 
Uh, one thing Hinterland is not known for is quick updates. Oh, you also have it on Xbox? <laughs> what were you thinking? Yeah, you can get it on Xbox, I think, the, the Tales. I have it on PlayStation, but honestly, when I bought it, it was because I didn't, uh, I still didn't feel like I was a PC gamer. I feel, I still felt like I was more of a console gamer. And even though in the, like, the previous six months moving up to that, I hadn't turned on my console at all. And so I bought it on console thinking, hey, this is the only game I'm playing on PC right now. If I get it on console, I don't have to turn on my PC. But it lasted maybe five to ten minutes, and I, I didn't like the controls because I was I had been playing it for a year or so on PC, and I couldn't, uh, had, or I was unwilling to get accustomed to the controls with the controller. That's basically what I'm playing right now. This is all interloper settings, but I did change to, aside from adding rifles and revolvers, I changed two settings. One of them is baseline resource. I switched it over to medium because in interloper, you can't get a lot of the DLC. And I want the stuff that I paid for. Um, the other thing is I reduced the blizzards one knot. Just because, uh, I mean, if you stick around long enough, another thing you'll notice about me is I don't stop and make fires nearly as much as what a proper interloper player would be doing. When I get cold, I just think, ah, where's the next shelter? I can make it there, right? And then I lose a whole bunch of condition because I didn't want to spend two minutes making a fire. All the other settings are basically interloper on here. Well, not basically, they are. Yeah, you can get lamp oil from fish. And if you are cooking the fish, if you have a jerry can, it'll put the oil right into the jerry can, which is way nicer than having a whole bunch of those little containers. Alright, nothing in here. Now let's go check the truck. This is a new run, so I'm only on day 8. This load for much longer. I'll do that. I do not like the gun books. Oops, we got a scrawled message. Oh, that's a hint. We don't need no stinking hints. 
Hey, D Rock. No, this is not my new streaming time. And Mitan, welcome in. It is going well. My stream times, this job has messed up all my stream times, like, and it's continuing to do so. Um, today, I thought I was working till 3.30 today. But, apparently when I finished the, the final course, he just told me, okay, alright, I'll see you on Monday. And so, he sent me home. And then, about an hour ago, he called me and asked me, hey, hey, I just realized, like, you still haven't done your practical forklift test. So, do you want to come in tomorrow? And I'm like, well... I guess. <laughs> and so, tomorrow's run, which should have been the uh, 9 to 11 weekend time, for, because that's my weekend, I'm going to have to change tomorrow to 7 to 9. And hopefully that works for y'all. And then Monday, he doesn't even, like, remember, my shift is supposed to be uh, 6 until 2.30. Sunday to Thursday. Uh, Monday is a holiday here, so we technically get the Sunday off. And so he has me coming in at 8. Again. And I'm not sure exactly what the reason for that is. But I'm sure he has his reasons. So yeah, my stream times have just been all messed up. And I can't wait until they're actually that so I know because I'm getting tired of trying to figure out when I'm able to do it. Lots of water. But what I don't need is you. Alright, sometimes, sometimes there's loot in here. Unless they changed it, sometimes there is loot. Why did I see something? Oh, I didn't. Alright, I can throw that on the workbench. I gotta hurry up. Burning too much lantern oil. place creaks and groans like an old ship. Uh, I want to get these this box and these lockers first. Consolidate the books. I wonder if I can drop. 
up any of this gear. All right, I'll come back for the safe. I don't see anything else. Oh, I see another lantern. Nice. <sighs> All right, we're getting mucklucks this time. All right, after the 30. Or right before the 30. <laughs> Damn it. 29, my favorite number ever. All right, after the 10, let's go back over here. Twenty nine eight, And after the 40. Oh, yes. It ain't my clucks. But we got good boots. Alright. Uh, let's continue using this lantern. Oh, we got a blizzard. That's good. At least that means I'm not going to get an Aurora. Um, you know what? I'm going to drop these books off at the door. Or slightly off to the side of the door. And I checked this, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't care about those books. Now, what will we find down here? Well, we got another Nobody stem. Will we find the rifle inside? And will it be just up those stairs? Kinda hope. Is there any wood? No. Any soda? Give me the rifle. I just don't want to have to go out to the cage to find it there. Well, let's be honest. I don't want to go outside to find it. Oh, I don't see it. else in there. Alright, it's not here. Well, I guess we're going outside. Is there anything back here? I remember finding something right around here. I don't remember what it was, though. Guts to hurry up. Alright, we got some food. Any good? Okay. Yep, that's edible. Uh, 
And we'll go up here and grab that chunk of wood. If it's there. Oh, maybe it's not. Interesting. That's almost always there. Oops, I always do that. Alright, can we run? Uh, oh, hey. Look at you. Temperature 16. Another lantern. Antiseptic. And nothing. Must. Must check it. <laughs> I can't not check it. anything you know what I should do is I mean looking at the time of day I should just I'm gonna you know what I'm gonna do it I'm gonna sleep here because that sounded like a blizzard earlier and you cannot go Upside this door and come back. Uh, what is it? It's 15. So what can I eat? I can eat you. Take the worst ones first when you go into bed. Now let's eat that. And let's drink a soda. Actually, let's drink two sodas. Sorry about that. Oops. I didn't realize that didn't fill up. I'm trying to grab a drink of my coffee, but I have like one of those big bowl mugs. So you can't exactly grab that quickly. Alright, what are we at? Uh, that's good enough. And let's eat up a little bit more. All right, and we'll drink. All right. Uh, <laughs> I need one of them helmets that holds the beer cans, just jerry-rig it with uh, the whole coffee mugs instead. You know what? Yeah, I do. I really do. It is cold. 
I think we're gonna go to Pleasant Valley after this. Actually, no, we're not. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. But I'm... And you know what? Maybe this was kind of stupid to do this, but... I'm checking the cave. I'm gonna go up here. I'm checking the cave and then I'm gonna go back. And finish up inside the dam. This actually could have held off. I could have just went along and got myself inside that other... Maybe the rifle was at that end, but... Starting to feel numb. It would have actually made more sense to do it that way than what I'm doing right now. Because I would have been just walking right past this anyways on our way out. Oh well. I did it. Looks like a new day is dawning. And a wind turbine to Good. on top to if power the heating them. element to keep them warm. Yeah. I like your thinking. Make that. Do I have, I have two of those. Well, I do have my, uh, my two bandages and the parts to make a third. I like how they lure you. Okay, no rifle out here. So, yep, that was a waste of time. I'll remember that for next time. You know what? I didn't even notice. Am I warming up in there? Totally didn't pay attention to that. There we go. Alright, I got a bow book I can read for an hour. You can't focus when you're this cold. I'm warming up though. Go another hour. Alright, and we can drink. I got those work boots. I gotta drop those off. I hope I find some pants soon because I do not want to repair these pants. Look at these things. They're at 37. Worst pair of pants in the game. I don't want to put a repair on those. Hey little bunny. You gonna make the sacrifice? No, you're gonna... Where are you going? Oh, there you are. Sneaky.
I'm going to take these. And this. There's Coach's favorite view. Once that cattail head Did goes out of there. I hate being cold because I really do. And I'm going to do that. We'll use that for the thumbnail for the YouTube video. Meet Coach's Day. Oops. I'm going to grab these cattails. Since we don't have a wolf out here. Oh, the wolf's not here. Those bunnies look a little suspicious. Maybe they did something to them. You know what, I'm gonna say this, even though this isn't my normal stream time, or my new stream time, I kinda don't mind it. Wait, I'm so cold, I'm warming up a bit. I mean, maybe when I'm, when I finally get to the 6 to 2.30 shift. Maybe it will be like four to six. Cause that still gives me plenty of time to go out and do stuff afterwards and not have to actually rush to get home. I hate rushing. Is there anything at all back here? Oh, there is a box. Contains nothing. I'm gonna grab any of those scrap metal pieces. I'm gonna grab them. I'm kind of interested in uh, doing what I was planning on doing in the previous run. And just spending an entire day at the forge making arrowheads. Alright, do we have the rifle here? Yes, we do. 51%. Anything down there? Nope. Oh, I forgot, you gotta... This time works for you, D-Rock. You get home just in time to watch. Nice. Yeah, I'm thinking 2.30. It takes me about half an hour to get home. Um, I'm gonna miss most of the rush hour, which should, whoops, that should speed up my, uh, my drive time. Uh, actually, no, I don't want to do that. I want to take the worst one and use it till it's empty. So yeah, I should, uh, 
should get home around three o'clock every day and then that gives me enough time to to shower and we'll see when the wife comes back from England she's there again and oh yeah maybe I can even eat and then I, I still have plenty of time I want to go out shopping because my current stream times um, I don't have time to go out my only time that I have is on the weekends so it will be nice All right. So the course I was taking today was the, uh, oh, there's a pot under the table. Which table? Probably the far one, right? Isn't that where, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Barely walked with this much gear. Thanks, Miten. Yeah, the course I was taking today was uh, the workplace violence and harassment, etc. And it's, oops, it's funny because I think of my first supervisor at my previous job and I just think, wow, everything he did would fall under the bullying aspect. I know, I know that they tell you in this course that like you're, you know, superiors are allowed, but just the way he did things. The guy loved to make you feel like you're an idiot and that, and let you know that he was superior to you. This will come in handy. Yeah, that could be a, another set of metal. Maybe one day. Alright. Well, I'm gonna have to go all the way back to the entrance. Uh, that's... I mean, I definitely wanted. Oh, hello. Never know. Another revolver. I like to dump my stuff off by the front door. That way, if I do come back and require any of it, I don't have to go through the whole dam. See anything underneath? If I'm coming back this way. I leave my water by the back door. You know what? That's actually a really. I can leave a couple more items by that back door. Well, Hello, whetstone. to have the knife on the handrail but now it seems to always be over by that uh, duct there it is oh lucky Ooh, it's 90 I don't even need to sharpen it at all 
That's going to be good for a while. This might seem stupid to y'all, but you know what the thing I'm most excited about for this new job? No hard hat, no safety glasses. Just a vest and some boots. And obviously the rest of your clothing, but... That last job I had hard hat and safety glasses all day. I couldn't stand it. I hate hard hats. They are so annoying. Whoops. I've already checked this area. Alright. Miten, you're a genius. You know what I'm actually gonna do? Uh... Actually, I'm gonna put that out first. And... What can I throw in here that I... I'm going to take... With me. To save some weight. Um, you're 54. Oh wow. That revolver I found has some bullets. I probably hit the weight restriction. Alright. How much does this one? That's got half. Alright. There we go. Now we're booking it. I'm really regretting my decision on my coffee cup today because I need a drink. Well, I'm regretting my decision even more now because uh, because it's one of those bowl style cups if you're old enough remember the show friends it's actually a friends mug it has central perk on it my wife bought it for me because I kept telling her I want my friends mugs out of my box but I don't know where my box is from before I met her and she doesn't remember them and they were much much bigger than this one this one's kind of cute the size that it is looks like an oversized teacup but uh, I'm regretting grabbing this because number one I can't grab it very quickly and number two the surface area is so large which is the one that one. The surface area on it is so large that it gets cold quick. It's already cold. Alright, boots. You can go down. Uh, make sure I'm wearing everything. Yes, I am. Uh, you can... Five minutes, do it. I'd like to throw a bunch of stuff in the locker just so that when I do come back... Oh, you don't have any bullets. And I don't have a rifle cleaning kit, do I? Firearm cleaning kit? So you may as well go on the floor. Uh, I can take that to Pleasant Valley. Oh, right. Where's the table? There's the table. There 
go. And you can go in there. Hmm. Yes, you're going in there. I'll keep one. I don't need these because I don't have a rifle that I'm going to be taking. You know what? I'm going to actually take that just in case. Alright, you can go on the floor. You got point two. What's the time of day? You know what? Let's do that. And let's refill this one. And we got that metal now. You can go in there. And just to be sure. Okay. Oops, wrong button. Come on, rookie. Let's go. Off to Pleasant Valley. You know, that body and those arrows shouldn't be here anymore. Ever since they took Fluffy out of here, there's really no reason. Alright, we're loaded. Uh, let's eat. See the wizard, the dwarf wizard of Timberwolf Mountain. Uh, let's eat this one too. Alright, how many cans do I have? You thought the body and arrows were a tie-in with story mode? I don't know. I always kind of viewed it as, uh, you know, a heads up that there's something in here that made this person shoot arrows inside of a building. Because I don't remember anything uh, really happening in the dam during story mode. I remember you have to come here to get the medication for the, the trapper. But other than that. Uh, and waiting for the Aurora so you can get inside the room to grab the medication. But other than that, I don't really remember anything other than that. If you're allowed to say other than that in twice in the same sentence, I just did.
Remember what's-his-face said he dealt with a woman in the dam. Maybe that was Molly getting her come up and s for offing her husband. No, because... Hmm. I'm trying to remember now. I don't even remember which episode Molly's in. Is that three? I don't know. You might be right. Maybe we should have a better look at her next time we go by. Oh, you know what? You might be right because Molly said she found a bow when we were supposed to bring the gun to her. No! Damn it! Me ten. Now I want to play story mode just so I can see what Molly looks like again and compare the visual to that body. You might have a good point there. Imagine being in real life where a cattail stock puts you over your weight limit. <laughs> the body might be someone that Molly shot. That is true. Because, yeah, there is no bow there. There's just arrows. This is a rookie move here, but I'm doing it. Just because I don't remember where this cave... I mean, you know me. I'd forget to breathe if it wasn't an automatic function. Now I'm wondering if I was supposed to take that first, uh, that first turn off, if that led to a dead end. Oh, look at that. Hello, all of you, Cole. 72. Oh, ours is 85. Yes, I'm walking around with two bed rolls. you got buddy all right I'm going through here because this one I know is a dead end That would seriously scare the hell out of me. Walking through a cave and you find a giant dead animal like that.
Take your time. I'm going to refill my coffee. Oh, you're so lucky. Yours is going to be hot. Mine's cold. more coal I must I, I must have a bunch on me at this point 18 coach isn't here so we didn't do a formal uh, coal count all right here we go No body there. Looks like we're gonna be spending the night at Signal Hill. That would be the safe plan. Give me some arrows. I want to start accumulating arrows. And I wouldn't mind getting somewhere where, like, early enough where I can just finish off this book. We got one. Looks like this has been here a while. And another revolver, which is coming out first. That one, good. Another revolver. You know what? Why take it? Oh, you got more bullets too. I can just leave that here. Why take it all the way to the farmhouse only to have to at some point bring it all the way back here to get it to the camp office to display, right? And I can just leave it right there. Um, I'm going to check this body first. I mean, we're not losing temperature. So there's no rush to get into the cave. Got some feathers. Give me all the feathers. Well, I'm okay with five. Hey, Mr. Kane, welcome in and thank you for the bits. I don't know if you saw tomorrow's stream time. Tomorrow's stream time is going to be 7 in the morning. 7 till 9. Because unfortunately, 
They want me to go in for an hour to do my forklift test. And meet and redeemed stretch. All right. Let's try this. Oh. Oh. yeah. There we go. Thanks, Mitan. So I don't know if you saw that, Mitan. In the uh, hunting blind, I found another revolver. I left it there. And we got to remember on our way back one day when we're heading back to Mystery Lake to grab it. <laughs> you'll slurp extra loud. Maybe you'll hear it 2,000 miles away. How long will this one be going for? Um, I've pre-scripted this one to be 97 episodes, because hockey season's coming, you know, and McDavid's like the greatest player on the planet, so, yeah, this one will be 97. Or are you referring to how long will this stream be going? <laughs> I don't know. The stream. <laughs> well, I got a McDavid plug in there, so... Suck it. <laughs> I'm not sure. You know what? Once I get in... The uh, Signal Hill building... I'm going to take a, a couple minute break because honestly my coffee is so cold right now and it's still almost full. And I can't go another hour with coffee that's starting off cold. It's not going to work. I might even change cups. Yeah, drink up. I oh, well, trust me, I am. Oh, I'm getting that sapling since I'm not losing any uh, temperature. Almost nighttime. Some maple. You hear that? I hear them. I hear them. They're right up on top of the hill. I am not hearing things. But I don't need one, so... How about we don't put a time restriction on today's stream? How about that? I don't know how long y'all can stay, but... I mean, I've said many times... Uh, 
the people on YouTube have been very, very, very good about watching the longer streams, so. Hey, Mr. Loeffler, welcome in. Would there be anything behind it? <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go inside. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna drop all my wood out here because I can't build a fire indoors, anyways. And that's it. Yep. Except for the sticks and the coal. I'm gonna go in here. I did not. Hey, Mr. Coach, welcome in, though. Welcome in. This pack is getting too heavy. Throw that. Hey, Dr. Kane, welcome in. Did you all go on Discord and see what I said on there? Cause I said something on there. I think I can use this. Peanut butter. Wires. Ooh, I need that. Well, I don't need that. Ooh. You didn't see it, you just woke up. Well. This this job continues to mess with my schedule. Oh, I see that. So, today I had to go in for seven, which... I really don't understand why he said to come in for seven. I mean, yesterday when he was trying to figure out what time I should come in at, he's like, what's a good time? And he looked at me, he's like, don't say four. I said, actually, I was going to say 4.30, so. <laughs> so yeah, I went in at seven today. I didn't have to be there. Uh, I was only there, I guess, today just to do the courses, like finish them up. And so when I was finished, he told me I can go home. And I think he made a little bit of a boo-boo because he phoned me an hour after I got home and told me that, uh, oh, hello. We'll take those. Told me that he just realized that I, I hadn't done the practical forklift test. So he asked if I would come in tomorrow for an hour to do that. Wow, did we find coffee here or what? Um, oh, son of a... I can't even move with this stuff. Um... Sixty-five. You know what? I can drop you. And... Oh, there's the bear. Hello, bear. Where the hell am I going? Oops, okay. Two wires. Three of you, and I don't have any scrap metal on me. It's dusk, so I can't be far behind. Is 
So yeah, tomorrow's stream will be seven in the morning. And then Monday will be my first actual start day. And he asked, you know what? I got Reishi, make sure. Yep. He asked that I come in Monday at 8. Which I don't really understand why, but. Um, let's build up the belly. I, yeah, I don't know why he said eight. I mean, I do need, I need a card so I can get into the building. He gave me a key or, uh, he gave me a code so I could get, uh, into the gate, but I don't have a card to get into the building. And they have to make that, but they make those in Vancouver. So. Time of day. Wow, it's early. Can I... Don't have a hacksaw. And I don't have anything... One and a half hours. You know what? What are they? They're minus 20. I just want to see. You know what? It's not that bad. Wow, that was disorienting. I couldn't see. I don't think I would ever wear those. Well, and they're four kilograms. Um, but I can harvest these. messed up as soon as I went outside like even I couldn't see anything I was like what the hell I can't like I'm just gonna drop that I'm not gonna rip them apart um you barely walk with this much gear you get a piece of cured leather out of an hour and a half which I find strange because I think of ski boots I think of like Cloth and plastic. But those are four kilograms. I can't do that. Um, I can eat a little bit. And let's take this. Drink this. And I guess let's do this. And we'll refill that. That's half a ha huh for what the hell. What the hell that doesn't count for a ha? Huh? Get out of here. Uh, you know what? I'm going to take all these cans. But where is the battery? There it is. I want to put the battery over here. This pack is getting too heavy to carry.
and why? Oh, am I? I'm probably inside of the door swing or something. That's odd. Oh, boo, Mr. Coach. Boo. Sorry, Miten. I remember you said you realized you didn't have uh, enough points for a bear. Coach does. And he did it. Yeah, y'all laugh. Laugh, laugh away. Can I get away with taking this? Yes, I can. Alright, that is the new me. From now on, I am not repairing towers until first I have the radio. And second, until I'm prepared for them to be repaired. Oh, did I just screw myself? I go down here all the time and now I just totally forgot the route to go. There it is. Over that away. Hug the wall. You can pretty much go it anywhere here. Just take it slow and steady. Yeah, that had me a little bit worried. Just because I wasn't really recognizing any of the routes down. That's what happens when you have it on auto walk and you're trying to uh, wipe off your mouse pad. You walk into stuff. Jesus, this is cold. Oh, it'll be warm in that barn. You're working on a second video for goading. This one's all about Milton. Nice. Let me know when that's up because I'll, I'll watch that. That looked like a pry bar. All right. I got another redeem for a stretch. <laughs> There we go. No bone cracks. Luckily. Nothing in there. Sounded more like an execution. 
Shut up, coach. I don't judge you. <laughs> oh. Why? Why? Why did I do that? All right, what do we got up here? What's upstairs? Well, that's your jab. <laughs> All right. Me then, what was that about slow and steady? We're doing it now. Not no more, but now we are. Me ten. If you want, you can probably post that link on the uh, Discord. We sometimes say hello over there. Hello, Bella Clava. Oh, you're not very good right now. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. Yeah, I don't think you can take damage when you fall in there. Just because that, that jump you have to take is just as high. As if you were to fall off of those planks. Why I get turned around when I come out of there. Hopefully I can check the car. I want to check this area too. Actually, let's put that away. I know that's coming out, so... Oh, there's the deer on the far right. Is there any more? I don't see any more. It's minus 20 and it feels like it's minus 1. I think I want to do that car when, uh, when I can see. I don't trust the bear. Yeah, we got a ton of bullets for the revolver. But... We also have, well, that's got a few shots in it. We have three arrows. So if I ever find a bow, depending on what I'm doing, where I'm going, um, I'm not afraid to leave the revolver behind. Anything out here? Matches. How are we doing on matches? 36 and 50. Alright, let's start in the basement and see what we can miss down here. Wow, that looks pretty bright down there. Right there. This will come in handy. 
That is, that is the one thing I don't like, though, is uh, the amount. You find so many revolver bullets when you put it onto the stalker loot. And I wish there was a way of reducing that, but still having the revolver. Oh, damn it. You know what I did? I left that sapling at Signal Hill. Oh, well, well, I have to go back there at some point anyway, so... It's not the end of the world. Is anybody gonna give me a hacksaw? flare pistol too. Actually, we have another flare pistol. You posted a link to the Discord? Nice, coach. Thank you. Did I miss anything? I don't think I did. Me 10 still hasn't figured out Discord yet. I barely know Discord. Barely. It's uh, it only I only have it because they were bugging me about it. Fort vest. You know what? Oh. Not quite as good as what we got. Jesus, sounded like the bear was in here. up there. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Salt. Let's go right there. We can do that. We can do that. And that. Still no hacksaw. Oh, you know what? Um, let's drink that and drop it. That should help a little bit. Oh. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Do I already have one? Yes, I do. Another lantern. This is looking like a lantern run again. Alright. Hmm. 
not to take a lot of time to brag, but you killed a bear and a moose in the birch forest this morning, and it was just exciting. That's, uh, that's actually pretty good, coach. They get both of them. Uh, let's get rid of all of you. And, oh, I can drop that wood. And did I have, I have one other can of paint. Yes, I do, I do. And. All right, clothing can go down. I gotta fix that balaclava. Although, I mean, I got two of these. What are you at? You're at 1.2. Come on. Why? Thank you. All right, 1.2. Oh, you're way better. Okay, and which was the good one? 81? You're the bad one. You can go up there for some leather. And I just kind of sort these out. Okay. Books. I'm going to grab the books and then I'm going to go drop them all off and we'll come right back in here. Because I think at this point I have a fair amount of them. Um, I can probably have a peek at the uh, cans. I guess seven. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm going to find another one. That's cooking skill. Those are both really good. And you can go there. You can go there. 18 coal. How many cans did I actually have? There's one. Okay, that should just leave me with two. Yep. And spray paint. Oh yeah. You know what? Spray paint can go in here. You can go in there. Uh, I don't need those because I don't have a revolver. Uh, you can go in there for now. Um, I got two lanterns. But I'm just going to go with uh, using the worst one. It's almost empty. 18 coal is more than enough. Oh, wait. We don't need to use that right now. More than enough to cook a bear on that six burner. Yeah. Should be. That's a lot of hours. Do it this way. All right, there we go. Uh, even though I want to burn through this coal, this coal, this lantern, um, I'm going to do my quick look, nothing behind the toilet, and then I'm going to come back 
or any of the drawers. Hello, Mucklux. Oh, you're only 21. That's legal. Pretty much everywhere. But I will make you a hundred. Alright. Containers. And what's the time of day? Okay. And cue the bongos. And make sure that, uh, Disappearing uh, sewing kit wasn't there. Honestly, it doesn't sound like bongos. You know what it sounds like? It sounds like a three year old with a drum kit. But I'm still gonna call it bongos because I. Just want to. Alright. Got all those. Bam Bam with drums. Bam Bam would break the drums. I've gotten all of this. I don't think I missed anything. Just kind of check behind there. Um, I can drop those. Hmm. For the love of mother... I could eat a horse. Let's see a lot, because I love horses. I love cows, but I eat them. I know what I have on is just as good, in your opinion. You like what you like. I like the nice boots. Gotta A to Z this. Wow, we're... Look at all the coffee. 25 coffees. Throw the carrots down here. Um, there's all my water. It can't stay over here. That's not where water goes. Water kind of goes over here. Uh, what else? Oh, the bedroll. You can go there. Come on. Give me the green. There we go. Oh, I didn't loot in here. Did he just pull rank on me? <laughs> no, I didn't pull rank on you. I'm wearing the boots that you like. Reluctantly. 
the slow boots. Well, they're not. It's not slow. It's not speed. It's your amount of stamina, isn't it? Isn't that what that is? That's the amount of stamina. That's your sprint. Yeah, see, I... Ah. Protection. Waterproof. They're not bad. I mean, I'm not... I'm not crying that I can't wear my other boots. But... I'm crying that it wasted... Two leather. Attempting it. Uh, 37. What can I get rid of? You know what? I don't need four of those accelerants. As I almost never actually use them. Oh, those things. Uh, oh, you can't put those on the radial, I guess. That makes sense. Uh, I don't need three of these on me they will make their way to the camp office one day but not right now oh hinterland fix this There, I got them both there. That was so annoying. This this issue with stems not wanting to uh, go on top of anything other than the floor just annoys me. And especially that one where it was flickering sometimes. Oh, I have an extra pry bar. Okay, no other extras. Still overweight, though. Why? What are y'all seeing that I don't need? I mean, I know there's a ton of coffee, but the coffee ain't making me overweight. Oh, idiot. Maybe the eight and a half liters of water might be putting me overweight. Yeah, that puts us back down to 27. That makes more sense. I'm going to take two and a half. And this is... Oh, freezer. We love them. Thank you. Hey, Mr. Wa, Wa, oh. Welcome to my mouth. Precious. That doesn't work. Thank you for the bits, Mr. Loeffler, and thank you for the bits, Mr. Coach. Thank you, Dr. Kane. Thank you, Mr. Kane. <laughs> what did I say to your nephew? <laughs> oh, yeah, Dr. Kane, you know what? Actually, as soon as I said it, I thought, you know what? That could go in another place, really. Alright, that's a hint. All right, Mr. Coach, thank you for the bits, and Mr. Loeffler, thank you for the bits. And Dr. Kane, thank you for the bits. And Mr. Coach, thank you for the bits. Y'all are crazy.
Thank you to all of you. Now... Thank you, Dr. Kane. Hype train incoming. Look at that. Thank you, Mr. Loeffler. Or how does it work? Y'all are doing it so much that it's messing up on my thing. Who's doing what? So I'm just going to give a big old fat thank you to all of you. Because in my chat, it's not showing proper anymore. What happens with the level 2 hype train? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Sewing though, right? Yes. And oh, thank. Thankfully, we got some more revol revolver ammo. There. See, Mr. Loeffler, my mouth doesn't work with other th words as well. Wow, Mr. Loeffler, thank you. Coach surrenders. <laughs> Thanks to all of you. I thank you very much. Yeah, you're so close. Admittedly, I have no clue what this does for you guys. Thank you, coach. So I'm I'm interested in seeing it get to level two, but I I mean I don't know what it does. Thank you again, Mr. Coach. Thank you for the bits, Mr. Loeffler. Level one completed. You did it. Thank you, Dr. Kane. Coach is out. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Kane. About to beat my last record. Keep up the support. Wait, uh, we've been in a level two before. Oh, you know what? It was probably that day where, uh, when I got my other job. The last stream before I started that job, and you guys just went absolutely nuts. <laughs> just one, the family slam. Yeah, that's when that's when Dr. Kane introduced his entire family to my stream. And y'all just went crazy. Uh, 
That was a memorable stream. There's a wolf out there. There's the barn. Alright, give me three arrows on that target. I don't even care if they're broken, just give me the arrowheads. Yes, for the record, coach is on overtime right now. And he has put his bits back in his pocket and is pouting. Because <laughs> I don't pay him. He does this out of the goodness of his heart. Alright, coach, how many arrows are we going to find on this here? I'm not going to look so you can cheat. Oh, although... Uh, we're going to find two. I was hoping for three. It's probably always two, right? Oh, and a hatchet. This will come in handy. Retreat. Uh, hatchet. Where is the hatchet? 76. I don't know which one I picked up, but I think we picked up the 76. I was hoping for three, coach. I mean, you'll if I found twelve, I wouldn't. You'd never hear me get mad. Uh, you can just hang out right there. Um, it might be a little risky, but I'm gonna try. To get out of here. And, uh, maybe get to, uh, the community hall. Yeah, nobody would get mad if they found 12 arrows. Unless it was, like, somebody who's new to the game and they sucked with the bow. Then maybe. And be like, why can't it be revolver bullets? I would love to find a bow. Something over 50%. Uh, let's not do that. Alright. What will we find upstairs? Another bow book. didn't have a hatchet. Now I'm just finding hatchets everywhere. Oh, thanks. I'm not quite sure I was holding enough of that revolver ammunition. What am I at? 78. <laughs> you know what? Uh, what is the temperature? It's 14. We can sleep in the truck. I'm gonna do exactly what I was saying earlier that I wish would happen. 
check my food situation. Um, I'm going to eat two of these and I'm going to eat that can. I'm just going to spend the night here. And read the book. And can I drink that? Yes, I can. That's good. Bow book or sewing? Let's use the bow book. I think we'll only get one hour if that. All right. Eat that. Drink up. Yeah, the cans are hard on your teeth. All right, we should be good. I'm going to eat some of these. All right, now I can drink up. I'm going to drop if I haven't dropped it already. Uh, 86. Yeah. Uh, Tied for first. You know what I can do? I can do that. I wouldn't mind a little bit later in the day right now. There we go. Let me out. Where am I? There I am. Okay. Uh, am I going to see it if I leave it there? Eh. I should. Alright, let's go. Uh, I'm not going to go over there. There might be a chunk of wood. I don't think I need to go there and risk aggro and a wolf. I'll take that wood though. You can go in there. Actually, you know what? You know my memory. If I don't move that outside... If I came back and I saw that inside the crate, I was like, oh, I haven't been here yet. Did I just hear a moose way off in the distance? Surely they're, I mean, even if it's in Birch Forest, that's way too far to be hearing one. But I just heard a really deep, low groan. Well, I'm seeing a bunch of wolves. Ah, you know what? I got nothing to take on a moose with anyway, so... <laughs> Dr. Kane says it was him.
Maybe it was coach's arthritis. Maybe it was mine. I do want to go to Birch Forest, though. Just do one of those things where I just grab as much of it as I can. Start off at the church. We'll wait, work our way towards the uh, community hall. bunnies. I thought I heard some clucking. Alright. Check out this area. seeing nothing there. Go get us some books. He's hearing chickens again. Yeah. And this time I'm not desperate for any, right? He's been smoking the feathers. <laughs> Well, that explains where all my feathers went in my last run. See me standing on the corner selling feathers. Alright, let's go in the house. Alright, same deal, quick sweep with the lantern and come back for the cabinets. I'm gonna take the can just because. And oh, come on, come on. 
And that one. Drop any of this gear. All right. Um, I got the two six burners here, so I don't mind having a bunch of cans on one. One seventy three. This stuff will come in handy. What do I have? Oh, you're better. You're not warmer, but you're in better condition. Yeah, I mean, ten. That's what I think. Just throw them in the community center. Throw them up on the stove. Piece of cloth. Why can't it be leather? Like, do I even have leather left? No. Thanks for trying to repair my favorite boots. And failing. Yes, I did. Onward. Wow. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Well, let's go in here. Should be some metal. Grab. Coastal house. Somehow I don't know that this is a coastal house. check this first and then I'll go down there. Oh, you're just a little girl. see anything in here go check the little hut what do I got for food how much well I got lots of food lots of food no storage box in there what do I have? I have 10 of those. I'm just thinking, you know what? I got cattails around here. I may as well. Oh, yes. 89. It's getting ridiculous. Yeah, 
it might not be a bad idea to start stocking up on cattails for when I uh, head to Ash Canyon and uh, the summit. I want that to be a thing. This needs to be a thing. A clickable thing. Oh, we still have this house. Nothing. Again, we'll do the quick sweep and then we'll come back for containers. there was something in that empty drawer or the open drawer anything behind the toilet nope probably zombies in that basement yeah big old zombie moose barely walk with this much gear just itching to mess someone up feel that way about the hallways in the dam I don't like I mean in real life I wouldn't be in that dam for very long oh please be better than these oh they are all right thank you yeah the dam is scary as you know what I mean I'd hang out in there if something chased me but if I heard those noises in the dam I was like starting to think that maybe that thing that was chasing me got in I wouldn't do good. I've, I've said before, I would not do good in a, a real-life survival situation, like an apocalyptic situation. I wouldn't do good at all. I don't think I would just suck at it. Oh, look at that. Roth. Um, let's eat that. Let's drink that. And... May as well get rid of that. That's good enough for now. Oh yeah, zombie moose would just be horrif oh, horrific. Horrifying. Like... If you've ever seen one, like if you've seen a video of a moose, like a big bull, uh, there was a lady in Quebec that was doing a study on moose and she knew all there was to know about moose, but she encountered one on a trail with her family. This thing came out, it was kind of a foggy day a little bit, or, no, it wasn't, sorry, it wasn't foggy. What is that? That's a recipe. It wasn't foggy, sorry. It was uh, a chilly day. And so the moose kind of came out of the, of the brush and onto the path right in front of them. And it was standing there. 
and you're seeing its breath and he's just staring at them and this thing the look in his eyes he looked like he was possessed and then a few seconds later you see him charge and the camera goes flying But it was interesting the stuff she did. I wish I knew the name of her channel. Uh, if she even has a channel. I, I saw this video years and years and years and years ago. And... She was looking for the aggressiveness in Moose. And... She found out that... Uh, like, when it's not mating season, she's like, you can... A lot of times, like, she was trying to goad them into a into an altercation, and they are like, nah. I'm just gonna hang out over here and eat. Uh, definitely not something you want to try on your own. She had years and years of studying that animal before she did that stuff. But it was just amazing to see. I checked that one. Imagine playing one of those indie horror games, walking down a forest path, and then you see a zombie moose in the middle of the path tearing chunks off of a bear carcass. Yeah. And then imagine it looks at you. <laughs> Man, I tell ya. Moose are not to be messed with. There's a reason they're the worst animal in this game. Hinterland knows. Oh, and speaking of Hinterland, I don't know... I think I can use this. Like, I don't know if any of the canes are old enough to remember this, but... I mean, Hinterland got their name from a, a wildlife foundation from back in, I think, the 60s or 70s. And we'd always see these little commercial slots for them. Not really commercials, but like, they'd show uh, just between shows, back between uh, back in the day before money ruled everything. And uh, television stations could actually air something that is uh, educational instead of an actual commercial. And there was a company in Canada which I believe, honestly, uh, still exists, called Hinterland. And they did these Hinterland Who's Who. And in these videos, they'd show you various different animals and give you, like, you'd get about 30 seconds to a minute where they explained everything you wanted to know in, in that amount of time about this animal and I actually saw one of those yesterday on TV and I couldn't believe it I haven't seen one of these little slots for like years and years and years Dr. Kane you remember it so yeah I was quite surprised seeing one on TV these days because, I mean, I guess if they paid they can show it, but um, I went in there, didn't I? I did, I did, I did everything in there is empty okay oh, I never checked this, did I? oh yeah, I did alright, I'm gonna pick up all my water because I'm like that I'm going to drink all of it. Yeah, they did the native to Canada animals. 
Well, not native to, but just, you know, animals you'll find in Canada, I guess. Broth. Go there. Salt can go right there. See, this sounds like we're on a boat. How many cans do I got? One, two, just three. And, oh, I got four chunks of wood. That can go down here. And potatoes. Gotta drop the potatoes. Look at all the coffee. That's like more than the last time I said look at it all. Alright. I think, you know what? I think I'm going to end the stream here. Um, so yeah. For those of you on YouTube who are watching, I thank you for watching and I will see you tomorrow.